Well, for the first time, both the Saints and the Pelicans will recognize Juneteenth, which is this Friday, as a holiday. The organizations join a list of others, including institutions like UNO. The university's president announced yesterday that Friday will be an official holiday. June 19, 1865 was the day when slaves in Galveston, Texas, learned that they were free, but the Emancipation Proclamation ended slavery in the United States two and a half years earlier. The president of UNO said that he hopes people will educate themselves about the significance of Juneteenth. We've been talking about it and trying to figure out a way to make it happen, but I, I just think that, that fundamentally it's time to take time and, and recognize the significance of freeing slaves uh, in America and celebrating our black community, and, and that allows us to take some time Friday to, to do that. You know, as president said that Juneteenth will continue to be observed as a holiday every year. One of the many celebrations happening for Juneteenth is a blackout bike ride. It starts at 3116 St. Claude Avenue. The bike ride will go around parts of the city while stopping at a few black owned businesses and uh, restaurants for food and drinks. Uh, it'll end with a block party. You're advised to get there about 630. The bike ride starts at 7. Head to WDSU.com if you want to register.